always it was always just anger and rage and animosity and getting to the next step and he's not doing it right and me yelling at him and him yelling at me and so it was just a constant fireball but when we realized that so much of that was a, was a reaction to the mold we just kind of gave ourselves permission to just have a reset you know we were like let's just reset let's be who we are let's be who we were when we decided to marry each other and see how that goes and from my perspective it's going very well <laughs> I I I just I I love him. I love him and I'm so thankful that you know if the practical side of our minds kept us together even though the love piece was muted, you know, um our practicality kept us together and then now it's like it's almost like a honeymoon phase because we went right from being married to having Elsa to having a special needs daughter to having two kids. Yeah. And the mold and and we never had a chance to really um enjoy each other and I'm I'm enjoying him now. We'll see what he says. She can't keep her hands off me. <laughs> <laughs> I I attribute a little bit of a little bit to the mold but most of it to the beard. It's it's the beard. Uh, but no, it, it's I mean we still fight but we're I mean like we're still in a high stress situation. <laughs> we still uh Elsa is still, you know, 2 to 3 years probably behind developmentally wise. Uh developmental wise. Uh and then couple that with Charlie our youngest who we haven't talked much about who's 4 who's probably 8 to 15 mentally. <laughs> she's just she's the uh just super super they're both super engaging children. Yes. Uh, a very very high maintenance which i have no idea where they get that from uh, <laughs> but i mean we we still fuss and we still fight but we're not deep anger i mean there's not any it it's not like it was and we're also not sick i, I can't remember the last time you know that i've i had a headache that um that i needed to take ibuprofen for when we were you know going through five a 500 pill bottle in a month and a half. 